We have more NHL trades to talk about. This one involves the Anaheim Ducks. They continue the sell-off of their pending UFAs. Ricard Raquel is on his way to Pittsburgh. We'll discuss the details coming up next. So welcome back to another video here at Top Shelf Hockey. As I mentioned, we have some more news from the NHL trade deadline. We have more deals coming through here. Even though we're past the deadline, we're just waiting for a lot of these details to be confirmed so we can give the official uh, you know, a, a report here of what was traded uh, before we get all the videos out. So uh, stay tuned. There'll be more videos likely recapping what else has gone down here. But in this case, we have Ricard Raquel being traded from the Anaheim Ducks over to the Pittsburgh Penguins. They get themselves a pretty good return here. They get Zach Aston Reese going back to the Ducks as well as uh, Dominic Simone, as well as a 2022 second round pick. And there is a prospect involved too. I'm just waiting to confirm who the prospect is. So check the pinned comment here. I'm just waiting for that last detail to come through uh, as I record this video. But essentially, they're getting two roster players in Aston Reese and Simone and a second rounder. Uh, and, and a throw in basically as a prospect. So that's a pretty good deal uh, for Ricard Raquel. Uh, obviously, he's somebody who's very versatile, can play all three forward positions, former 30-plus goal scorer, uh, should be able to add some extra offense into the middle six part of the lineup. Um, so that's a pretty good acquisition. We heard Brian Burke earlier say they're pretty happy with their team and may not really do a whole lot. And they were kind of bound by cap constraints, which they are, but obviously two contracts going out kind of offset what we have here for Raquel enough that it was able to make it work. So uh, the Penguins get themselves uh, some additional help and the, uh, the Anaheim Ducks get themselves a couple of players they might be able to build in to their uh, future needs here as well as along with a pick and a prospect. So let me know your thoughts on this trade down below in the comments. We'll discuss further. Of course, this is your place to get all your updates on NHL trade deadline 2022. Stay tuned for more recaps as more details emerge here from all the last minute NHL trades. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time.